Okay, my friends, this one is for men and women alike. Um, now, if you're over 40, uh, then you need to know this. You're not 20 years old anymore. Uh, you can't eat, sleep, and train like you did in your younger days and expect the same results. Your body has changed and has different needs. You should adjust your health and fitness priorities accordingly. Now, just recently, I was men mentioning to a few people that one of the leading causes of injuries in older people, well, mostly men, physical injuries, is that they tend to attempt uh, feats that they used to do in their teens and 20s at a high level. Now, as we get older, uh, we decline physically, and we should know or come to the realization that we cannot um, do things that we used to do at the same intensity level. Now, the good news is that strength training does slow down the aging process. I know many of us hear and see a lot of things on TV or in videos on, the, on social media claiming that they are anti-aging, but there's no such thing as anti-aging. What we can do is slow down the aging process with a healthy lifestyle that incorporates strength training and good dietary supplementation. Now, for all of you who have not started a healthy fitness uh, or healthy lifestyle, I would recommend that you get clearance from your doctor before you begin any strength training program. And once you get that clearance, you know, start in a gym, start weight training, strength training. Um, you can get guidance from a personal trainer. You can follow reputable people who are <laughs> online sharing their fitness journey and so on. But I just wanted to share that um, with you guys that, you know, as we get older, we need to adjust our training, um, training regimens. Uh, we can't you know, do the things that we used to in our teens and 20s at the same intensity level. So be careful, guys, and strength training all the way.